All right, let's get this thing on the, on the stand. God, look at this. Look how hard it is to push. <laughs> I definitely did something to this thing. God. All right, let's see how this works out. Yeah. Hopefully we don't drop it, you know, on camera, babe. We can just edit it out, right? <laughs> We're gonna get started. So take a look. We'll show you the damage up close right now. I'll give you a couple good shots. Okay, so um, it's been sitting out in the rain. Obviously this was off it, so obviously it got rained all up in here, which you can see, it's dirty. It looks like, it looks like they pulled this and snapped that off just to get underneath here. Um, yeah, they jammed this. So they jammed the lock. Oh, dude, they jammed the front lock. These guys are amateurs. Whoever did this, this is the thing about these people stealing bikes. They just, they have no idea what they're doing. Yep, look here. Come take a look at that. So that is jacked up. Um, obviously the ignition, they did the wiring right here as well. Um, it doesn't look too bad, but I can pretty much tell you that it's, it's gotta be totaled. So the plastics are scratched up. Those, let's say the plastics are 300 bucks. We're just gonna round up. Um, bars are scratched, that exhaust is scratched. I know that exhaust is 500 bucks. Um, what else? I think so here. It got hit right here. Oh, it broke the fork. Okay, yeah. So it broke the mounting place for uh, the front fender. And I don't see much else. That exhaust, oh, is it bent a little bit? No, the frame looks fine. And then nothing up here. Oh, this is broken right here, the whole thing. So that's broken. Uh, obviously the chain from sitting outside, the bars, this looks like it's from one of her crashes maybe. Right, so I mean that's, and basically that's probably what, the, what everybody will say, they'll be like, dude, we can fix that for 200 bucks, but that's just not the way it is. So you have to take into account labor, you have to take into account like any of the towing fees that came to get it here or um, like the towing companies, stuff like that, because the insurance company adds that all up and then they're like, hey, it's, it's above a certain point, and then they call it quits. So, um, uh, what else? Uh, oh, well, I mean, he doesn't have, where does it go, babe? Where does your foot go? <laughs> uh, oh, you know what? The harness is jacked up. That's what's gonna be a problem. So we have to take the entire bike apart, relay the harness, the new one, if they do it, which they're not, this thing's gonna be totaled. So it's definitely gonna be totaled. Um, but yeah, so the options are they, they have, um, they can buy it back. The only thing that stinks is sometimes the insurance will not let you buy it back. So I've already talked to them about that. I said, Hey, you need to, you need to force the point of buying it back. It's your bike. But the problem is, is when the insurance cuts that check, it's no longer their bike. So the insurance can do whatever they want, but you know, that's all in negotiating. Yeah. So, and I'm pretty sure they want this back because it is sentimental to Rudy. So we'll just, you know, we'll see what the deal is. But I did get an email from the insurance, so I do need to get started on it and get them the photos that they requested and the damage. So, okay. So I'm going to tell you guys a couple things, uh, a couple of the most expensive things that are wrong with it. So first one is the exhaust, $569. So $569. Um, front right, the front right fork, 300 and something dollars. So that's already $800. So, um, I don't know. I can't remember what, uh, Coparts, not Coparts, <laughs> Coparts who's going to take this bike if they don't buy it back. I can't remember what, uh, do they have State Farm? W whatever the insurance company's number is to, to total the bike. So that already is a thousand dollars. So. Just with those two things, $1,000, let's say the bike's worth 2,500 bucks, it's not gonna be, it's not gonna be, yeah. Yeah, come on. I'm trying to tell them what's going on with Grommy Bear's bike. Okay. <laughs> so just with 1,000 bucks, 
that's already, like even with my label, let's say I've charged them 200 bucks to do that. That's, that's $1,200, that's almost half the motorcycle. It's gonna be total. So that's the deal there. I'm gonna send this into the insurance company and send it over to Grammy Bear, let them know what's going on. And hopefully I can, you know, steer them in the right direction of buying the bike back, which they do wanna do. They've already mentioned it. But I think we're, I think we're good to go. So I'm gonna shoot this off. Let me know if you guys have any questions, you know, go check out Grammy Bear's channel. They did a nice little video on it. And uh, yeah, anything else, any questions on insurance, let us know and we'll take care of it.